Yeah. <coughs> Sorry. Fire away. Yeah, the drill at the end there, taking the, the no contact jerseys off the quarterbacks and letting them get in there a bit. Yeah. Person. Yeah. Um, that's the, those drills are usually few and far between, but I think uh, you know, most of these guys haven't played at all, uh, quarterbacks in terms of at the college level. And one has played just a little bit. And uh, I think you can fall into a real false sense of security if you never uh, you know, make them live. Um, scary proposition. A scary proposition when anyone's going live, to tell you the truth. I mean, these other guys go live a decent amount, and I'm always keeping my fingers crossed. But I think we're as smart as we can be and try to balance getting really accurate, good work um, and realistic work. So, yeah. First day of full pads, uh, any just thoughts on that? Well, yesterday was full pads. Oh, okay. Yep. But and, we didn't get to Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and so I thought yesterday's probably uh, energy was a little bit better than today. You know, day six. And I think to some of these guys, even though it's day six, it probably feels like day 60 instead of six. And so hopefully we come out this afternoon with a little bit more energy. I thought it was good at the end. You know, you turn them loose a little bit, they crank up the energy. But we, gotta be, we, we need to be able to get that done more than 10 minutes of the practice. Will we be in full pads again this afternoon? No. No, we'll be in helmets this afternoon. So we'll correct a lot of the things that we just, all the errors that we saw out there, we'll go and try to correct them this afternoon. Are you starting to see a personality on this team? Yeah, I, 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 I like the personality a lot. I think we've got a lot of good kids. I enjoy these guys. We, we have fun out there. Uh, we really do. I think it's it's good. Now, we still got a long way to go to come together as a team when uh, things are going to go just right, uh, how to be truly unified how to treat our teammates, uh, that's work in progress, and that's always, that uh, doesn't, doesn't come with a snap of fingers. If there's a peak, mark, a peak trademark on a team, how close is this team to having that trademark on Oh, we got a ways to go, and I can't even answer that until we go through, you know, some real tough times, and we know those are coming in the Pac-12 for sure, and, um, you know, just even the schedule in general, I mean, our first game, like I've said forever, I mean, we're, we're behind the eight ball, Hawaii's had their coaches for a while, they kind of got their system, and we're still putting ours together. So uh, that's going to take some time. I mean, um, just how like, important is it to you to just do every little thing right? It, 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 it's everything. And, uh, you know, I was thinking that out there today. It's funny you asked that question because, uh, you know, there's, I turn to one drill and it looks pretty good, and I turn around look at another drill, and uh, I'm disappointed and depressed. And I'm thinking, I wonder if this is ever going to get how it's like just really needs to look at all times. Maybe when that happens, we don't practice. I guess that's why we come out here and practice. I know it's early in the camp, but have you noticed any guys emerging as leaders on defense? Well, I think some of those kids that have played for a while, you know, I think uh, team who's doing a nice job, Danny Sheldon, I mean, he's he's always got something to say. Uh, so we've got to get that harness in the right direction. <laughs> but he's doing a good job with it. Uh, Shaq's doing a good job. I think Marcus Peters is being positive. And, but it's work in progress. And like I said, I mean, hey, we haven't, we haven't had, we haven't hit any adversity walls yet. That, that's when, that's when guys show their colors. Is running back starting to sort itself out at all? Uh, no, because again, we, I mean, you saw how much live we've done nine plays, and uh, I think you got to play those guys a little bit to sort that out. I mean, I, I suspect that you know, it's not going to be one guy. It's going to be a few guys. I mean, we just now, it'll be a few guys. Maybe one guy gets more carries than the others. I mean, that's to be determined as a long season. That thing will evolve and adjust. Have you had that? Did you do that back at Boise State, or was there always typically one guy? No, we've always done it by committee, and then depending on you know who really emerges, and you know we've had some good backs over there, Ian Johnson and Doug Martin, and you know those guys, uh, you know, eventually started to kind of separate themselves. So we'll see if someone does that here. Speaking of Boise State, you made an interesting kind of ruffling feathers when you voted yes for the five, uh, Power Five versus Power Five. Can you talk about that at all? I can. Uh, I'm glad you asked that. Um, you know, I think I was misrepresented okay. in that article over there in Boise. I mean, I wouldn't do anything to try to keep Boise. I don't think of, first of all, I don't even know when I answered that question. I had a lot of questions coming at me. I didn't really know exactly what it meant yeah. uh, in terms of, you know, I think we're trying to get some parity in terms of scheduling, yeah. um, in terms of league games that we play that we're all on the same, you know, footing there. But I think a Boise State is, you know, I don't know if they're in a power conference, quote power, but they're a power team. Right. And so I'm always a Boise State fan, and I wouldn't do anything to keep those guys, you know, so-called out of the mix. So we, go ahead. Would you rather, would you still want to play a team like out of the Mountain West, or would you, would you rather have power, like the 
big conferences and play only the big conferences. Hey, I've been in that conference forever, and I know the players and the coaches that are in there. Yeah. So there's no question that we'd want to play those guys, and I know they want to play us. Yeah. I mean, there's good players. That's great competition. The, the general vote, though, to, to grant the Power Five more autonomy, um, what was your, your thought on that? I think if we can do more for our student-athletes, that is good. And if that's going to allow us to give them more food, maybe some more money, I think that that's really good for those guys. Mm -hmm. Good. All right. Yeah.